Hey there guys, this is Jet Seekers here and I'm bringing you a um, LEGO Transformers review of LEGO G1 Optimus Prime. I made him last night, um, and um, he is pretty big. Um, for a little bit of a size comparison, here is um, Deluxe Jazz. As you can see, let me just transform LEGO Springer really quickly. I know it seems kind of odd to be jumping right into size comparisons, but yeah, it's just something I like to do. And if you guys have made this yet, tell me. And um, here is Springer. Yeah, about that big. And he, I did give him rubber wheels so he can roll, but just kinda because the Lego um, axles were a little tight. And um. Oh, I guess I should have used the axles down here up here for the arms and these for the wheels. I'll probably fix that. Um, I did give him smokestacks, the long ones, so and I'll poke your eyes out. I mean, what idiot would be stupid enough to take this and go, Oh, I poked my eye out, Sue Hasbro! Yeah. Okay, sorry about that. Um, I forget it where I was, and I went to do some things. This video was this is a little continuation of it. It's still the review, but uh, I won't bore you with that. Um, here he is, and I'll just show you the transformation. Um, he is leader class size. I'd say okay. Start. You bring out the arms, bring them forward, stand them up. Now here's what makes him a little better than one I made a couple years ago. You slide out the legs. That makes him look. That makes him look a little better. Hem pieces are falling everywhere. Okay, then flip the feet forward. Use the camera. Flip the head over. Okay, there's a transformation. I just need to check something on the camera. V Prime Robot Mode, I'm back. Sorry about all these little cuts. Um, I just want to make sure I'm staying under my limit. And he looks very, very nice. And um, the neck piece is a little off. Um, he, he just looks very nice. Um, articulation. Um, head can rotate 360 as well as kind of go up and down just from the transformation. Um, the arms can do a full 360 bend at the elbow, rotate kind of at the elbow, and swivel in and out. Then onto the legs, it can go forward, back, bend at the knee. Okay, so here's Prime. One sec. So here's Prime. Um, looks very nice. Um, very big. There's a good shot of him. He's um, about leader class in size. Yeah, and I did give him a gun, which can peg into his hand, which I did make out of mini fig legs there. They work for individual finger articulation and all that jazz. And I want to make a trailer for him, but I don't have the parts, but here's his laser rifle. And he fell apart in half. Sorry about that. I'm having battery issues, and so here's Prime. He kind of has a gaping hole in the back of his chest, and I may find a way to put something in there, matrix or something. Have this bit pulled down so he could light, so he, he can open the matrix. Yeah, so that's about it. So transform him back, take off the gun, pull back the hand, and just fold in the arms. Okay. Like so. Gotta make sure everything's lined up to fall in the arms. And um I'll show you how I did the legs. Um there's that kind there's this um piece in here that there's that um clip thing, Lego connector thing. That's three long and allows it to slide so you can slide them in. And then of course hold the feet up. It's nine degree joints, ratchet click simple click joints and flip joint right there and there's prime in half. 
one of the problems I'll probably have to glue that. I have glued Legos before, and they eventually wear off, but it just makes for a tighter fold, and yeah, that grill falls off. Put that back on. And he's a little loose, but he is still good, and he's prime. So thank you for watching. Tune in next time. I'm Jet Seekers. Peace out.